Hi, this is Blake Angelos from Yamaha Corporation America, here with the all-new PSR S670. The PSR S670 is the most affordable arranger in the new PSR S series, and it has some great sounds and great new features. First of all, the entire cosmetics of the instrument and the controls have been greatly enhanced with new multi-pads, with bass ports on the side, better speakers, all sorts of great things. In addition to that, with a Yamaha UD WL01 wireless LAN adapter, you can stream both audio and MIDI bi-directionally to and from the instrument. It works great for playing audio files and for also recording two things like an iPad. And it's great with our new Chord Tracker app, which is an amazing app that we have that's on the market for free. Very cool. Also new to the entire PSRS line are two assignable control knobs and I can assign to various parameters for voice control, style control, even audio input control. That's another great feature about this product is an aux line input that you can route any iOS device, MP3 player or whatever directly through the internal speakers. It makes a great addition to anybody's home that would like to have just a nice speaker system for any of those devices. Yamaha has been making handcrafted acoustic pianos for well over 100 years, and that experience is brought to bear on their electronic musical instruments as well. So check out this amazing grand piano sound. So that's the grand piano sound. And since Arranger workstations are all about instantaneous music, I selected a style to go with that. The great thing about Arranger workstations is that they're very wide, they're not very deep. So all of the operations are very easy to get to. You don't have to go through a whole bunch of menus. And since I have sounds in here, I have all these great styles. So when I decide inspiration strikes and I wanna do something like that great bossa nova sound, I can immediately get to that style with just the push of a button and I can save it in a registration memory, which allows me to recall everything, an entire snapshot of how everything is set up on the keyboard with one button push. The next voice I'd like to show is called slide classic guitar. This is a very expressive nylon string guitar voice, but it has a nice slide into the note as I play with a higher velocity. Check this out. So that was the slide classic guitar sound. You can hear how expressive that is. 
I also added a style that's called the chill out style. It's kind of a cool, sort of a nice electronic style, but it's really nice to play with that style. I love that sound. The next voice I'd like to show you is the jazz flute sound. This is a really cool voice because it's very expressive, but when I play with a higher velocity, you get the overblow sound of the flute. Check this out. Another sound that I'd like to show is the muted trumpet sound. What I like to do is blend the right one and right two, so I have both voices playing together, and it's great with this jazz pop style. The PSR S670 has a brand new kind of style called a DJ style. So what a DJ style is, is a style that has in the variations chord progressions that may occur. And it allows you to take your hands off the keyboard and use other control sources to manipulate the style in the same way a producer would. So that's where these two new assignable knobs come into play. I can assign these to control various functions of the style or the voice, and in this case, I have them set up where knob one is assigned to mute tracks and bring in different tracks, like the bass and the phrase tracks of this dubstep style I'm gonna show you. And then knob two is set for cutoff frequency and resonance of the filter that controls the entire style. It's a really cool effect, check this out. So that was the dubstep style, and you notice that I use the assignable knobs to control the aspects that I talked about earlier, but I also added the multi-pads. Multi-pads are new to this instrument, and what they allow you to do is to bring in some of the internal sounds and add them to the playback of the style. But another cool thing about multi-pads is that they can also stream WAV files directly from a connected USB flash drive. So check out this style that I have some of those WAV files being assigned to these multi-pads. Relax, make yourself as comfortable as possible. That's what I want to talk to you about. Relax, relax, relax. That's what I want to talk to you about. Another great feature that was added to the PSR S670 is 32 megabytes of flash ROM. So what that means is that I can go to yamahamusicsoft.com and download voice and expansion style packs and customize this instrument for my music. 
A great thing is that we also have a new version of software called Yamaha Expansion Manager that allows me to combine different style packs. So if I find something from one style pack, I can combine it with another style pack. This previously wasn't possible. Before, I would have to install only one single expansion pack, and that's all I could get. And then if I wanted something different, I'd have to erase that and install a new one. Now you can combine them, which is a great new feature. A great thing about all of our arrangers is that you can instantaneously record the MIDI data directly to the internal sequencer. But it goes a little further with the PSRS 670 because then I can take that sequenced style that I've just recorded and I can record it directly to a WAV file. That's a great feature. It allows me to do lots of cool production and instantly realize it and instantly be able to take it to the computer, maybe convert it to an MP3 and email it to my friends or my family or my fellow musicians. So once again, I'm Blake Angelos with Yamaha Corporation America, here with the PSR S670. If you have any questions about this product or any other products from Yamaha, don't hesitate to contact your Sweetwater sales engineer. Thanks for watching.